It's part three of our interview with the great Liberty DeVito, who's just released a book simply titled Liberty. I'm John Bone from Rocky Street Music. Remember, there'll be more information on Liberty's book in the description of this video. Also, information on how you can buy a t-shirt. We have every color you can imagine with different logos, Rock History Music, Rock History Book, or Rock History Canada. How did you meet Billy Joel for the first time? We, uh, I actually knew Billy when I was 17 years old. Um, we played in a, in a club called the My House on Long Island. And uh, he was in a band called The Hassles, and I was in a band called The New Rock Workshop. And um, we used to just pass in the dark. And uh, just say hi. So we knew each other, you yeah. know, for a, for a long time. When uh, you were talking about uh, the ending of that, you, you I, I think a lot of us have gone through this. Well, I lost my job. I lost my wife. And, 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 you know, sometimes my father used to say, first of all, you're not a snake. And I go, what are you talking about, dad? He'd go, but sometimes the, all the skin has to come out and it's almost a new beginning. Hurts like hell. But I mean, did you have that? Did you ever at that point when you were losing your marriage, you were getting out of that band. Was there any part of you that thought, I'm got, I'm, I give up? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, I, I was done. I mean, uh, you know, you have those thoughts of like backing the car into the garage and turning it on. You know, it's like, what am I going to do now? All of a sudden, the, the bubble burst. You know, you live in a bubble. I played with Billy for 30 years. I lived in a bubble for 30 years. I can do anything. I can buy basically anything, you know? Then all of a sudden, it was gone. And it's like, what the hell I do now? Did you ever splurge with cars or anything? Did you ever, like, go kooky with, like, buy sports car? And... No, I had a motorcycle, you know, stuff like that. I moved down to Florida for, like, nine years. And, you know, it's, it's, it's the law. You either have to get a motorcycle, play golf, or play tennis. So I got a motorcycle. You picked the right one. Okay, Shani, I think she's telling me, let's get to some questions. I've got one here from Tino. Do you still keep in touch with Billy? And he hopes to see you together again. He wants to see us together again, huh? Everyone wants to see you together again. <laughs> <laughs> I'd rather get together with Billy again than my ex-wife. I'll tell you that. <laughs> but a boom. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Hey, you never know what happens, you know? You never know what's going to happen. <laughs> well, you ended that movie with a very sim similar sentiment of... Uh, you know, I mean, Randy Meisner, I talked to him many moons ago, one of the last big interviews he did. Yeah. And he said, you know what? I, I said, I'm sick of the drama. He says, don't get me wrong. I get mad sometimes. Yeah. But he said, for the most part, as I get older, I realize it's for me harder to hold on to. But he says, I have my weeks. I have my months. But uh, as far as being in that, in the Eagles, you know. Yeah. Well, what, what you do is like, at the moment when that happens, it's like, uh, you know, like falling and, and hurting yourself. It, it, after a while, the scars are there, but you, the pain is kind of gone, you know? So it, it becomes like that, you know, it's like, and I look at my life now and it's like, well, I'm really glad my wife wanted a divorce and I'm really glad I don't play with Billy anymore, you know? Cause it's, it's, a, it's you, you, if you want to become better, you do, you become better. If you want to be a loser and think you're a loser because somebody cut you loose, then you become a loser. <laughs> I chose to take the road of like, I want to do it over again. Again, you know? another Eagles thing, Joe Walsh in the Eagles special says, you know, at the time it seems like all these crazy pieces are flying around. It makes no sense. And you look back at it. It's like an opera when you look back at yeah. it. It definitely is. I mean, uh, you know, it's funny. I keep saying that, like, oh, I'd really like to do this again. And I think, well, my age, man, how much longer do I got to go <laughs> to, to do it again? You know? What's your favorite Italian food? Oh, my favorite what? Italian food. Oh, my favorite Italian food. Well, I, you know, I, I've since stopped eating meat <laughs> since I got older. And, and I quit dairy, believe it or not. But spaghetti and meatballs got to be, <laughs> you know, spaghetti and meatballs. <laughs> Lord's 52nd Street, how active were you guys? Well, before the, the um, yeah. this virus thing happened, we were playing all the time. Yeah. Uh, I mean, we, when we came home, <clears throat> right before they shut us down, uh, we, were, we just did a, a week-long thing in Florida. You know, we would go to Florida, play for a week in different places and stuff. And we, we were blown away the opening acts. You know, Three Dog Night, uh, uh, Little River Band. We were killing them. 
You play with Matthew fun. Friedman, right, Mr. Piano Man? The, 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 didn't you play with Matthew Friedman, the guy from yes. New York? Yeah. yeah. We know yeah, Matthew. Like, you know Matthew? Yeah, we know Matthew. He's a great guy, Matthew. We have like three different piano guys, four, four actually. Uh, Dave Clark is our main one. Um, and and uh, but but they all have other gigs, you know. So if he can't make it, then Matt is there, you know. If Matt can't make it, then this other guy. It, it goes like that. But the the three guys, the Lords, are me, Russell Javers, and Richie Canada. Yeah. You know, and people like they hear scenes from an Italian restaurant and they go, "Oh my God, that sounds just like the record." Yeah, it's because you got me and Richie who play, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Make sure you comment on our videos, subscribe to our channel, and share our videos. I'm John Bowden from Rocky's Tree Music. Mm -hmm.